So I found out that the scanning of the keepers doesn't do anything bad. So either way, welcome back to my Mass Effect One. Uh, let's play. I will scan the keeper, so I need to go up again. In light of the recent attack on Eden Prime, many colonial investors are pulling their support for future projects. Proponents of expanded human colonization insist that Eden Prime was an isolated case. Nevertheless, colonist enrollment has dropped sharply. Many colonial proposals are on hold until backers have some reassurance that human colonies will be adequately protected. Open up, thank you. So, let's see. I found a map. So it's kind of cheaty beady. If I understand the map, I'm not really good in that shit. <laughs> so, i standing here. And then. Side. There's a keeper. Okay. And then we go back here. There's a keeper. Alright. And then there was a keeper, alright. with one of the council's assistants. Who's on top of the keeper? Awesome. Then I'll talk to him, just for fantasies. Commander? Commander? Mm, nothing really interesting. Then we go up the stairs. Is that right? Then you have the council chamber. And there is the other one okay so I got those then I need to go back Nice music. A Solarian excavation team has run into an unexpected problem after unearthing a Prothean dig site. Hanar protesters have blockaded the dig site, claiming that artifacts of the Enkindlers, as the Hanar call them, should not be disturbed. The excavation team has appealed to Hanar representatives on the Citadel to reach a diplomatic solution. Yeah, you were there. Awesome. So, let me see. Um, I'm gonna go there. Alright. This one. That, that one. Please do not disturb the keepers. Why not? Why not? I don't disturb them.
dum. That's all to dum. Do you desire to learn of the Enkindlers? Or has the Honorable CSEC officer enlisted assistance? What's going on here? The CSEC officer requests that this one purchase an evangelical permit to spread the truth of the Enkindlers. If that's all the CSEC officer wants, why not just buy the permit? The truth of the Enkindlers is universal. This one humbly believes that the truth should not be suppressed. Exacting payment as a means of imposing limits upon the truth is an abrogation of this one's religious freedom. Who are the Enkindlers? Your people know them as the Protheans. They are the true creators of this one's people. The Enkindlers raised the Hanar from ignorance into consciousness by granting this one's people the gift of speech. So you're breaking the law by preaching without a permit right now? The CSEC officer states that preaching in this place is forbidden and preaching anywhere on the citadel requires a permit. This one humbly submits that it is not preaching to state the truth of the enkindlers, and thus no permit should be necessary. Let me talk to the CSEC officer. Perhaps I can explain the situation. This one would be most grateful for the assistance. Please let this one know if success is achieved. That Hanar refuses to listen to reason. Why can't it act in an orderly and lawful manner? Are there laws being broken here? I am not unreasonable. The Hanar is free to spew its nonsense once it purchases an evangelical permit. So if the Hanar gets a permit, it's allowed to preach? No. Registered evangelicals must follow regulations. There are specific areas where preaching is legal. Failure to follow the regulations results in the forfeiture of the license. What's the purpose behind the evangelical permits? Forcing religious evangelicals to register for a permit weeds out undesirables. It keeps the area safe. The Citadel is too important to become a battleground for a religious war. If you'd like, I could talk to the Hanar for you. I have argued with the stubborn jelly all afternoon. You are certainly welcome to try. Has the CSEC officer been assuaged? I'll keep working on it. This one will continue to spread its message. Has the CSEC officer been no, assuaged? No, I don't know what to do. Is this really how you want to represent the Enkindlers? The truth of the Enkindlers must be made known. They gave the Hanar language, and gave the universe the mass relays. This one only wishes to spread the truth to any who will listen. There is no intent to cause trouble. What if I purchase the evangelical permit for you? Finances are only a partial limitation. This one does not believe that one should pay in order to speak the truth. However, this one also does not possess the 150 credits necessary to purchase the permit. A hundred fifty credits. This should cover you. This is a most appreciated action. You are not of the Hanar but you wish to help spread the truth of the Enkindlers. This one will not cause any further trouble for the CSEC officer. This one offers its thanks. Hmm. And he's gone. Just poof. Oh, no. Gone. I see the Hanar is left. Thank you. Happy to help. Here, for your assistance in this matter. Now, if you'll excuse me, I should report to my superiors. What did it give me? Oh, it's an extreme medical journal. Oh, that's this guy. That's nice. So I did it good. I'm happy. All right. So if I go here, there are a few more keepers. Oh. Um. 
Um, do I need to go to the upper side or the lower side? I don't know. I really don't know. Does it even matter if I'm up or down? Good in here, let's see. Binary Helix has settled out of court with a Krogan group that had accused the Genetics Corporation of fraud. The Krogan group had contracted Binary Helix to Where perform studies to? with a long range goal of curing their genetic sterilization. The group later sued for a return of investment money when the study produced no viable results. I think I'm going to security now. I didn't want to go there, to be honest. Yep, I'm at the security thing. Oh well. Um. Shepard here with the Alliance military. First time on the Citadel, that about right? How did you know all that? I'm the CSEC requisitions officer. I need to make sure our buyers are authorized. So, will you be purchasing anything today, Commander Shepard? Show me what you got. Excellent. I hope you find what you're looking for. Whoa. Whoa, I don't think so. And nope. No, that's way too expensive. That's out of my league. I cannot afford that. This is not where I need to go. Probably I need to go to the other side. I need to go here. Here. If I'm doing the right thing. Probably not. There you have those two. That one. Is that? Well. Hey there. Oh, you're not CSEC, are you? Did you want something? What are you doing here? I am Jaleed. I came here to seek aid from the authorities, but they won't listen to me. My colleague is trying to kill me. And I thought we were friends. How do you know he wants you dead? He's changed. He won't talk to me at work anymore, and he started following me. Yesterday, he followed me all the way home, just waiting for a chance. I don't care what anyone thinks. He wants me gone. I know it. Is there something I can do? Uh, talk to your friend, maybe? Would you? That's all I want. Someone to talk to him. Tell him to leave me alone. He thinks he can just push me around, but you'll show him, won't you? Just tell me where he is and I'll go find him. Oh, right. Well, he wanted to meet with me down in the wards near the markets. He said he just wanted to talk, but I know better. His name's Shorban. He's a Salarian. You shouldn't have any trouble. He's just a scientist. Shorman? Yeah. That's the guy who asked us to scan the Keepers. The Keepers? Well, even more reason to go after him. That's against regulations. I better look into this right away. Find out what he's up to. Anything's possible with Shorman these days. Well, good luck! Hello, you. Right, 
There should be a keeper there. I don't know why I'm doing it though. Codex. What I do there, but what am I doing? Move out of my way! You're in my way. Alright, let's see, where's the next one? I smell trouble! Smell trouble? Trouble in what? You smelly. If I go here, go here, here. Do, 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 do. In remembrance of Eden Prime, we present another profile in courage with serviceman Nirali Bhatia. A devoted wife and talented chef, serviceman Bhatia joined the Alliance military under the Deferred Education Plan. After finishing her service, Bhatia planned to open a restaurant. Instead, she gave her life protecting the colonists of Eden Prime. For more profiles in courage, or to explore opportunities in the military, please visit the Alliance military on the extranet. Keyword, courage. Yeah, open. Good. There should be one here too. I know you. You're Shepard, right? Yeah. I was on Mindwar during the Blitz. Saw you on the vids when you got your medal. You saved the whole colony. Looks like you have a fan. I'm sorry. I just never thought I'd meet someone like you in person. Uh, my name's Lang. Officer Eddie Lang, Citadel Security. It's an honor to meet you, Commander. What are you doing down here in the wards? Anything I can help you with? Why'd you join Citadel Security? I don't know. Seemed like the right thing to do, you know? Maybe it's in my blood. My grandfather was a cop back on Earth. It's kind of what CSEC is. Police for the Citadel. I'm still pretty new at it, but I like it so far. Way more interesting than staying back on Earth. You get to meet all kinds of cool aliens. Like those Hanar. Wild. Plus, CSEC gets a lot of respect here. We uphold the law. People, even aliens, appreciate that. How do you like working here on the Citadel? This place is amazing. I've been here almost a year, and I still haven't seen a tenth of it. The Presidium's just so beautiful. Good place to go and relax. But I really like it here down in the wards. There's always something going on somewhere. Like that new club they just opened a few months ago, Flux. Wicked scene in there, Commander. You should check it out when you have some time. What do you know about Spectres? Just the stuff they show in the vids. They always make them out to be super agents on secret missions to save the galaxy. I know it's not really like that, though. Some of the other CSEC guys don't like them too much. Figure they shouldn't be able to operate outside the law. But if they were so bad, the Council wouldn't use them, right? Do you know a CSEC officer named Harkin? I shouldn't really say too much. He's been on the Force a lot longer than me. But I've heard things, you know? Drinking on the job, taking bribes, that kind of thing. Rumors mostly, but they suspended him, so some of it must be true. I have to go. Probably. Right. You're probably right. real busy. Well, see you around, Commander. Okay, thanks, bye. Alright, after end this episode right here, I think there will be another episode of scanning thingies and seeing this whole city. Hope you guys liked it. It's kind of boring the last few episodes because I'm just walking around in the city. But it is lore friendly, isn't it? But I hope you guys liked it, and I hope I will see you guys in the next episode that I make. Bye bye.